was no better than her husband. She did not, of course, have a hairy face. It was a pity she didn't, as it would have hidden some of her fearful ugliness. Take a look at her. Ah! Have you ever seen a woman with an uglier face than that? I doubt it. But the funny thing is that Mrs Twist wasn't born ugly. She had quite a nice face when she was young. The ugliness had grown upon her year by year as she got older. Why would that happen? I'll tell you why. If a person has ugly thoughts, it begins to show on the face. And when that person has ugly thoughts every day, every week, every year, the face gets uglier and uglier until it gets so ugly you can hardly bear to look at it. A person who has good thoughts cannot ever be ugly. You'd have a wonky nose, a crooked mouth, a double chin and stick out teeth. But if you have good thoughts, they will shine out of your face like sunbeams and you will always look lovely. Nothing shone out of Mrs Twit's face. In her right hand, she carried a walking stick. She used to tell people this was because she had warts grown on the sole of her left foot and walking was painful. But the real reason she carried a stick was so that she could hit things with it like dogs and cats and small children. And then there was the glass eye. Mrs Twit had a glass eye that was always looking the other way.